Hi, I'm Alex from Stardust Collective, and today I want to talk to you about some of the gameplay systems in our game, Ziggy's Cosmic Adventures. So let's just get started of flying through this level. Let me just set my speed, press the button, and start on our way. So we're aiming to get to that warp station out in the distance that uh, you can see there. And so we're going to have to fly there, but there may be some things along the way we're going to have to deal with. Now, in the game, there's two main categories of things you're going to want to be doing, and the first of those is flying the ship. So this may be dodging out of the way of any asteroids or other obstacles in your way, but also at the same time shooting down any enemy foes or just blasting some asteroids because it's fun to do. Now, at the same time as doing that, as you step back into your ship, you realize there's the entire rest of your spaceship for you to be managing. Now, the way that you manage this is particularly through power management. So all of these different systems have batteries that you then have to make sure are powered up and plugged in to whichever system you want to power up. Now, how do you get these batteries? Well, that's when our very good friend, oh, we just got some enemies flying past there, but our very good friend Ziggy comes in. I mean, oh, look at him, he's so cute. He's so cute, aren't you? Oh, poked him a bit too hard there. But let's get more Ziggy friends. We can actually print another Ziggy friend for us to enjoy here. Let me just check that everything is going all fine outside the ship. Oh, and I think we've got some enemies coming in to shoot us here, so let's just turn on the shields preemptively, make sure that we're not going to take too much damage from this particular encounter. So, in order to get these batteries, you can um, either get them through Ziggy, which I'll explain in a bit, but also there are some pickups in the levels where you can pick up some extra batteries, um, so you can also choose to get your batteries that way. So let's try to get both of these batteries and then we're going to fly through this booster ring straight past these satellites. Now as we're doing that, I'm going to check up on our Ziggy friend here. You're doing good? You're doing good? Cool. I'm going to chuck you into that box there, our extractor. And then we're going to... Oh, I think I crashed into an asteroid. How am I doing? Oh, we got some more. Okay, we'll deal with Ziggy in a bit as I just shoot down these guys. Okay, cool. Cool, we're doing good, we're doing good. Um, let's turn off our shields there. So, we're now going to take this empty battery and we're going to chuck it into here and press the button and now we're getting a fully charged battery. We do also kill Ziggy, um, but that is a sacrifice that must be made for the greater good. So we're going to take this battery and I think uh, what's going to need it most, probably our life support, that is a good candidate for getting some more energy. Now after this Ziggy does get a little bit stinky, a bit toxic gas coming out of him, so we're gonna have to say goodbye to our very good friend as he uh, goes on his own way. Now let's um, also, yeah, let's turn on the fans, just clear out the toxic fumes that are in here, and that should be a bit better for us. Now let's try to fly on past these, but we don't have any energy in our batteries, oh whoopsies, drop that. Let's put that into there, now we should have a bit of energy there. Now let's get an empty battery, so that we can recharge that. At the same time, let's get a Ziggy ready um, for when we need to get some more batteries ready. Cool, let's also fix this. Um, so some things that generally go wrong at times, and they're not like critical to fix, but they will help you on your way, just optimize your route through the level. Okay, and now I think we're doing good here. So I don't have too much energy, so let's get another Ziggy ready to go. Um, chuck that into there, do that, let's get this extra battery. So where should this battery go? I think, yeah, life support is normally a good shout to keep that powered up. I think next we're going to want to make sure we have shields as there are enemies now ahead of us that we're gonna have to shoot down quick because I don't have any more battery juice for my um, for my shields here, that is, yeah, that's basically empty. So let's get that out ready. Sort out our temperature again as it is getting a little bit cold here. Oh, that's too hot. Okay, uh, there we go. Cool. Um, let's get another Ziggy out here and uh, say goodbye to both of them. They can uh, have some fun together um, on their own adventures. Okay, let's just make sure we're 
going in a straight direction here, and I think we just ran out of energy there. Um, okay, oh, I almost forgot. We picked up two batteries earlier in the level. Completely forgot about them, so I think we're actually completely fine. <laughs> um, let's get another battery into shields, though, as I think that could be a useful thing to make sure that we have energy for that, as I do believe that, yep, there's some more enemies that will be chasing after us. Um, so some shield energy is definitely going to help um, make sure we don't take too much damage here. Okay, I think we're good. We've got past that little section. How are we doing for batteries now? Um, I'll get this ready just in case we need it. Oh, dropped him. Butter fingers. Okay, and oh, we've got some more and on my shields. We've run out of energy. And oh, our stabilizers are broken. That's not good. Let's try to fix our stabilizers. If you take too much damage, your stabilizers are going to have to are going to break, and then you're going to have to go and fix that. Okay, one more enemy to shake down. Oh, and he's he's decided that we're not worth it. Okay, okay, we got it. We got him before he flew away. Nice. And yeah, so we made it to our warp station. So in other levels, you're not necessarily always flying towards this warp station. For example, in one level, you're actually defending the warp station from enemy fighters, from missiles that are flying in. So that will be a fun one. But I will save sharing the details and sharing the gameplay of those other levels for another day. Thank you um, so much for watching this uh, little sneak peek of our game here. And I hope that you will buy it and enjoy our game when it comes out later this year. Woo!